Hello everyone, Andrew here. Thank you all for tuning in and I hope you all had a lovely Christmas. And if you don't celebrate, I hope you still had a, a very lovely holiday season. And today I'm doing uh, another video in VR for Japan's Rally because this is my favorite Christmas tradition, rallying in VR. Also, I got some comments saying, you know, when's the next Richard Benz Rally video coming? So I'm giving the people what they want. And recently there's been an update to RBR HUD, which I described in my last Richard Benz Rally video, which basically adds a real life dash to cars that didn't previously have it. And one of those cars has been my beloved Ford Escort. I did two rounds of Sim Rally Masters in this car at the start of the year. They didn't go very well. That's why I only did two rounds and not a full season. But I really enjoyed driving this car. Probably my favorite in RBR. Was well, one of my favorites at least so yeah we're gonna give it a whirl right now we're gonna drive on rally school mix one of the rally gp stages this is a really fun half and half tarmac and gravel stage it's best to run a gravel setup and running a gravel setup car on tarmac is actually a lot of fun so that's why i really enjoy this stage anyway without further ado let's get to it so with the way i've got the camera set up you can't quite see the dashes but i think just having a clear dash there is immersive in and of itself and seeing the dials move in even in your peripheral vision even if you didn't use them you really sort of go off up by the engine note to, to know when to upshift it still just adds so much i think it's the small details is what creates immersion in my opinion and again this this copy is very nicely detailed i've got to say even on a, a car that kind of looks like a normal rbr car i guess uh, not to discredit the work that's been done but that's just sort of how it looks to me. Also, I'm running an Ari Vatanen livery on this car, but you can't quite see it because, you know, obviously we're inside. But I've waffled on enough. To put my shifter into H pattern mode. Make sure we're in first. Three, two, one, go. Okay, and off we go. Not Square the quickest left. car Square to get up to speed, but Bridge, I do enjoy. I love starting the stage in these S's, Square really right. highlights Titans. how Titans. loose the car is. Right. Get the Titans. rear wheels Titans. back onto the road before we hit that bridge. Fair for the throttle to go around the corner. Not always the most compliant car. It likes to Square understeer. Left. It likes to oversteer, Over usually, 60. Right. 60. when you want it to do neither. Let's already load up the fronts to get it to turn. Square left, 180. There's a forward. proper rear wheel drive rally car, this. Oh man, that was not a good corner. Car just washes. Washes out. I always get that corner Square. wrong though. Square left, onto gravel. Square yeah, onto right. gravel now. Half long. Try and hit it with the old Scandi flick. Not the best Scandi flick I've ever done in my life. Now we're on gravel. Character of the car changes completely, as you might imagine. Two left, one ten. I like the start of this gravel section. It really, this is obviously rally school meant to teach you about rallying, and I think this being your gravel instruction does a very good job. Lots of undulation, lots of elevation. This bit's great. You really feel the weight of the car disappear through the force feedback. Needs a break here though. This jump. Oh my God, talking of my co-driver. Oof. Very easy to hit that rock on the inside and then the trees on the outside. Should have downshifted to fourth, but that's not a problem. Take this corner of third. Very long. Very long corner. I let the gears drop there a little bit too much, I think. Two hundred, push, 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 push. Darren says, "Okay." Stay middle. You have to move the wheels so much Five in this left. car. Does Five not favour minimalist driving style. Oh, ran very wide there. Go on, get back on the road. Square right. Right back Titans, on tarmac. Titans, Sixty. Four right. Titans. Titans. Sixty. So we've got this opening bit all over again. Five left, cut, 120. I am making a very Square liberal left, Titans, use 90. of the surface I've got to race Three on right, here. 70. Square left, That's a nice Titans, point when you get it right. Right, you gotta initi initiate the sound before you downshift Care. for that corner. Square right, 110. Okay, now we go right. Long times to two. Cut. That was better. That was a better scandy flick. Shot three left. Square right. Bridge. Lots of long Square corners right. now. Plus three right. Long. Three left. Long times to two. One hundred. 
running a bit wide there. They should put a rock there to discourage you Square from doing right. that. Square left. Bridge. You square, square right. right and left. It's actually quite fun in this car. On this setup. <laughs> Come on, the end of the stage is right here and I'm making mistakes like that. Well done. Thank you, Darren. There we go. So that's the Escort. I, I enjoy driving that car. I think I was a bit liberal there with my um, with my driving and how much of the road I was using. Usually I was off the road, but it's rallying. They can't have a go at me for that. Anyway, that was a lot of fun. Let's try a different car now. So it wouldn't be one of my rally videos without driving a Subaru of some kind. So I'm going to drive the best car in the game. I said it. It's the 995 championship winning Subaru Impressor as driven, of course, by Colin McRae. So we're going to go for that. And for the stage, I want to stay on gravel. I don't, I'm not in the mood for experimenting today. And I'm going to drive on Skogby. <laughs> I hope that's how you pronounce it. This is stage is a lot of fun. It's only five kilometers, but it's got a good mix of speed and technical section. That's what I look for in a rally stage. I like sections where I'm flat out, but I also like sections where it's tight and twisty and a bit technical. And this is exactly one of those stages. So yeah, let's go for a while. So here we are then on Skogby. I've got Bob the Builder over there giving me a wave. And I've got to say the interior of this car, I've said it a lot, but the interior on this car with RBR HUD is exceptional. The modeling in general is just fantastic in this car. Like all the little details, I would prefer to have seats so I knew where to really properly align my VR headset. And also just the added immersion, it'd be nice to have a co-driver next to me. But I've got to say, I'm not even, I'm not, and that's not a complaint, that's a nitpick. This is, looks exceptional. And uh, as well, again, just the immersion of sat in a car like this. I'm never gonna do it in real life. This is the closest I'm ever gonna get. So, yeah, let's get to it. Handbrake in. Make sure we're in first. Three, two, one, go. Two right, half long. This car right, sounds right, amazing. Right Six right into overpressed. It's not a different beast from the right, escort, of course. And three right, but it's still a beast. Low. 50, overcrest, 70, six left. This corner catches me out. A lot, not that time though. Overcrest. I'm gonna keep it in fifth. Three right, Titans, care in, mind the bump, 150, nice. Three left. Bit tricky that corner. This bit's great though. Fifth gear, flat out, tuck it in, little slide. Square left. Lovely. Three right, long, care in, 100. Load up those fronts, get the car turned in, that wasn't the best. There is a Suzuki Swift in the ditch where it belongs. Wide left. Tightens to three. Over crest. 140. Over crest. 170. Wasn't steering with one hand in this car. As it should be. Long tightens. Over crest. And and crest. Okay. 250. Ooh, that was a little bit more slide than I meant. <laughs> Five right. Right, this is where it gets a bit technical. Right. Stay right into square right and don't cut fifty. Sorry, break the early. Break way too early there, but that's fine. Jump. Best break early and break late. Three left, tightens. Well, too late. Three right and two left. Long opens tightens. Track's very narrow here. A little bit of banking there. Three right, ninety. Over crest and okay. square right. Fourth was fine. And far left, 90. In third gear, come on. Over crest, jump. All right, stage speeds 90. up again now. Over crest, 350, come on, let's go. Oh, the sound of this thing. Proper boxer Caution. engine sound, right, this. Right, tightens to three and far right, over crest, 140. Tightens to three usually means I'm about to die. Square left, tightens, tightens, six left, short, and five right. Bump, 190. Four left, and cut, into four right, cut. I'm not cutting down, I don't trust you! Oh man. I have ended this race. 
your car is serious damage to the finish is right there by that building <laughs> i just poked my monitor i mean that's that's the true that's proper mccray fashion that is isn't it flat out and he said cut oh shit player area not found okay <laughs> anyway oculus giving me shenanigans darren my co-driver he said cut i mean that uh, whatever that that is proper mccray that so Anyway, I'm going to sort this out and I'm going to move on to the next stage. Final stage of the night, I think. I tend to like to do three for these, but I'm going to do a, a, a cool one, don't you worry. Okay, I've now decided to take us to Finland, to the Hassi stage. I'm going to drive something modern, well, kind of modern. It's the Toyota Yaris WRC 2018. An absolute rocket ship of a car, especially in RBR. It's absolutely amazing. Hassi, much like Skogby, the stage we just ran. There are sections that are very technical and there are parts that are very quick. It's a bit longer and it's a bit more tricky, so I'm gonna try really hard to uh, to make it for the first run. I've crashed a lot in my practice runs for this video, so so yeah, let's get to it. Also, Toyota have really re reclaimed the name Yaris, haven't they? Like I used to think of a Toyota Yaris as like your mum's car or your friend's mum's car, but now, especially a GR Yaris, is quite a desirable car now. So it's quite interesting how. Toyota have turns that name around. Okay, so here we are then in the cockpit of our Toyota Yaris WRC again. And if I bring, just thing I want to uh, point out the detail, the level of detail, and the level of attention to detail that's gone on in here in this car is astounding. So if I pull the handbrake in, put it into gear, the dash all the way down there that you will never see is is a, is a working dash. Incredible. Anyway, let's best focus on the driving. I'm always blown away by the grip these cars have. The front tires are so compliant. Some of those corners are very tricky. This corner is very tricky. Downhill. Not as easy to get right. And jump. Okay, 250. But we're through that first sort of technical. Flat left, 140. Part of the stage. Five left, and. Three left, tightens. Four right, minus. Over crest, 110. No, 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 no. Four right, and. Five right. Those moves kind of look very cool when you get into the ditch, but. Crest. They're not and good for my survivability. You can't take that jump, you'll die. Right. Look at the crowds. Oh god, pay attention to the road, Andrew. Left. A, sl a, sl a spun round. So easy to do that in this car. So easy to spin in these modern cars. Alright, this is five where this right. stage gets scary and flat left long and jump into five right narrows 160 flat right and big jump hold on four left 150 oh you got a break for this right, 100 keep it tidy oh, i wasn't brave enough to take it five in left, six 200. that's a downshift four right 100 over crest and five left, 130. Did you see that guy on the inside? Right, narrows and four left, long, tightens, tightens, and three left, tightens, two right. Four right. Oh wow, that's the part of the stages. So scary. Hello, ladies. Three left, 100. <laughs> Why are those late women there, man? And Five left, long. Right, I always get a bit lost on this section of the stage. And by lost, right. I mean I crash. Over crest, into far left, and three right, get narrow, double caution, three left, bridge, 130. Oh no, I didn't turn early enough. Come on. Over crest. Come on, Yaris, into you and me. Right, and don't cut, 100, caution, big jump, hold on, far left, tightens, tightens, over crest, flat right, don't lift. Oh, he said don't cut. Uh, broke right, the radiator. Flat left. Why do I keep damage on for these videos? Oh, fuck. Flat right, 130. I have 
broken a tile. Okay. I just want to get to the end now. Oh, come on, man. I've lo uh, I think I've uh, consumed too much over Christmas. It's affected by concentration. I, I'm not selling this, am I? Man, I, I'm not made for this, man. I'm going to shut up and try to get to the end now. Oh, there's the end there. Oh, that's handy. And that's the finish. Well done. <laughs> oh man, I'm, really, I'm sorry if towards the end of the stage I was crashing there a lot, but I really hope that at the start of the stage I really highlighted how mental this car is on the, on a stage like this. I couldn't. I don't think I could do this online. Like if I was doing an online rally, I don't think I could drive a modern car like this. But yeah, this has been a lot of fun. I'm really warm now, so I think I'm gonna get a drink of water. Like I said, guys, I hope you really enjoyed the video. I hope you had a lovely Christmas and holiday season, regardless of what you celebrate. If you'd be so kind to leave a like on your way out. And also, if you really enjoyed this content, please consider subscribing. I'm, I would like to reach 500 subscribers by the end of the year. I think that would be not something I've ever thought would be feasible for my channel. I thought it was always going to be like a sort of subscriber a month kind of thing. But I've gained well over 100 subscribers in the past month. So thank you very much for that. It means a lot. I will make some more videos before the new year, hopefully. And yeah, that's all there is to say. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you all next time.